Yes, good morning, good morning, my people. Good morning. Oh, no, don't know who it is. Y'all know who it is. It's the Red Shot Black Star. All praises unto the Most High. Give God thanks and praise for this morning. Beautiful morning. I get up and I have health. I got strength. I have ability. I'm here. Uh, my family is okay. All my children is okay. You know, I ain't got no sickness. Functioning. Gotta give thanks. Thank you to the Most High. Praise be to the Most High. So when the Most High does these things, you know, no, I can't really depend on man for man to do this. I, this is a thing I don't care about. Nothing else. I know my Lord is who gives me health and strength. Every man. No guy don't come to my door, to my bedside and give me that. I get up in the morning and I receive that. I'm the most high and I give thanks and praises unto the universe, unto nature. Yes, people, you don't know I'm a red shirt black star. And I bring it original. I bring it, it's authentic when I bring it. Um... I dropped a video yesterday uh, talking about the coronavirus and I'm learning more about it um, I'm getting to find out more details about the coronavirus and I'm getting to realize from putting certain things together and I had thought about it before but I never wanted to uh, just come out and just put it out there like that. I know that the Most High says in the last days they'll have many plagues. But I know the coronavirus is not a plague to say from nature or um, uh, 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 um, uh, from God. This coronavirus, to me, was modified. This coronavirus, I went to my bed yesterday and I had a whole vision about this coronavirus thing. And in my dream last night, what I dreamt about was, I saw a group of faces and they had masses over their face. They look like doctors, uh, but higher, scientists. And they was in a room. And the room was full of corruption in, in that dream. But this group of people, they was working so hard to create something that was going to create great problems on the face of the earth and in the dream they um the main character that was the head to modify this bacteria was a two-faced individual one of the face side of the face was like a skeleton, you know, skull, no meat, no flesh, nothing, just rotten. On the other side, it wasn't pretty, it wasn't looking like a normal human being skin, healthy skin. It was a face, it had flesh, but the flesh was not. Uh, I would say the flesh didn't look like flesh. It didn't look like a human's flesh. And and that side of the person's face of what I saw in the dream, the face kept on changing and the side of the face. But the side of the skeleton stayed bone dry. And in the dream, that person with the two face or oh, that entity had two sides of face, like I said. And that individual 
when I saw them, it was very evil, dark, uh, 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 evil darkness in, in the dream. And I would say from what I get from my dream, that it allowed me this morning to say that the coronavirus Uh, the coronavirus is always there, so we know that um, the coronavirus is it, 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 it more affects animals, actually bats and 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 um, birds and stuff like that, and uh, rodents, because the bat is like a big rodent, it's like a big rat with wings. But we know there are certain bacteria and diseases that are into certain animals and certain parasites and certain stuff are into certain animals or creatures that when these creatures or these animals or former species has uh, these type of bacteria or uh, these type of diseases like the bird flu or, or the coronavirus or or my cow disease or um um like we know that it's a transportation from one to another in other words we have dogs and the dog feces is very it carries certain um bacteria in it that it's very unhealthy it could kill it could kill you and with the bats the cows the chickens, the duck, you know, even feeding the salmons, uh, bird, um, chicken poop and pellets to eat. And then we go, that's the salmon in the farm. And then we go and we buy these salmons and we eat it. We doesn't know what type of bacteria by these fishes eating these chicken poop or these pellets to defecate. What is the trans, um, what is transpiring within that animal's body. So when we come and we eat what that animal eat, if that animal caught a bacteria or a disease from another animal, and we find that this bacteria is just transporting itself from one species to the next. So in other words, um, and this is how bacteria or viruses become so powerful because I says any uh, living organism, a key purpose is to survive. So, let's say the bird, or let's say the bat, because we know there's like all type of uh, other insects that carry massive diseases that leash, leash on these bats, so these bats eat, or these animals eat, so they are into the that digestive tract there in there so when one bacteria move from one vessel or uh, one species to another species it is upgrading itself from this species to that species it's upgrading itself so now we know this um coronavirus been around it's been going on going from animal um body to bio um, species to species and it's it's cooking up itself but in my dream to what i got and knowing that it's like every first we had the AIDS, uh, I think AIDS first, we really first started hearing about HIV in the 80s. In the 80s, we really started to start hearing about HIV. Before HIV, there was um, syphilis, herpes, gonorrhea. I call it bag of wire, but it's the same thing, it burned. So they had these things. And we have poli um, 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 polio and, and we have e Ebola. It's like every 10 years or every 15 years or when it, every 20 years, there comes a massive disease that's going to wipe out the population. And you have to ask yourself, is this a way to genocide or to eliminate uh, the populations of people in the world? For every 10 years or 20 years, we have a major disease 
a virus that just comes out from nowhere. So if we know the coronavirus, like they say, it was always it always been there. Why now, all of a sudden, this coronavirus, scientists is finding that it has a a a uh, attachment of a cross breed anyway with HIV. Uh, why would HIV? Or uh, the bacteria that causes HIV, why would it why why would it be in the corona? Why would that link with the coronavirus? When they are two separate diseases, why would the coronavirus have the same type of ability as the HIV or as the Ebola? Or as other diseases that killed and destroyed the human body or the human vessel in the manner that it does. So we got to be mindful upon what's going on and half of the story never been told. There's a lot of things going on how they're going to manage or balance the population. So now we hear that it could be a... Uh, uh, China is a massive country. It has the most people, I could say, in the world. And they're wondering, is it a way to eradicate China or cripple China? That's what some people are saying. But I'm saying, it's New World Order. And I'm saying that these things have been going on for a long time where there are different type of war and now we are living in the, the 2020 year 2020 and um, we see it's a different type of war we see how it's so simple that people could kill billions of people I was watching a movie or uh, couple years ago where it did it, it it had to do with the cell phones where there was this new type of cell phone that came out and the government was trying to in the movie to assure that everybody had one of these phones but these phones was the type of phones that the people at the base could send anything through your phone. As you see, we have the iPhones and we have all these phones and we see how easy it is to send messages, text messages. Uh, we see how easy people send viruses into people's um, um, gadgets, in, in, into people's computer. We see how easy it is for somebody to just wipe up your entire account and all of that, simple little things. We see how easy it is that, um, remember, whenever they invent something, they, they just don't invent that one particular thing. If they say they invent one thing, actually they invent six things to work with that one thing because they're always going to have a, a, a um, I would call it a sample, which is of the original motherboard to able to intertwine with all what they make because you buy a cell phone sometimes your cell phone go blank or it, it get hard the people don't call you and tell you squeeze that button this button that button and you see that lap down air thing that if your phone was shut down locked down and couldn't come back on and you couldn't take it back or put it back on you would call the team mobile or you call your phone company and your phone company would actually advise you what you couldn't do how you could get your phone back on when your phone was seized not coming on when you thought that was it so there are ways that when they create the viruses and they create the inventions, how they always away, how they could override whatever that they have into that system. So we know we have our phones and our phones could be a uh, way for we to catch certain diseases and viruses. And some will say, well, how that could happen? Well, it's simple. Sometimes you're using your phone, you feel your phone, your phone get hot. Sometimes you're on your phone and are... Uh, you know, there are certain things that you see is not working right. There are certain viruses. If you doesn't have a lookout virus, tell your virus coming to your phone or something, you will not know. If you doesn't have something protecting your account or your phone, 
anything anybody could hack into your phone and do this. So the same way people could hack into your phone, hack into your bank account, hack into this, uh, you know, it's the same way they could hack in. They could, they could create your phone to become a problem to you as we know that the phone is giving cancer in the air. We know that now we are moving to 5G. This 5G is not everybody don't really know the full definition of 5G. Faster speed, faster internet, faster all that. But there's more behind the 5G because the 5G actually is so powerful. The light on your phone on the 5G is so bright, it could kill, it, it could kill bugs. You could take the light off your phone on the 5G and put it on a bug and, and, and that light is so bright it will kill that bug. So imagine that you have that phone into your ear or you have dealing with this phone on a 24-7 base. So they have the ability to create this stuff and to lodge out this stuff, to send a code and it release stuff. So I was saying, I saw this movie where everybody was to get this phone, this new cell phone that came out, it was the cheapest phone, when I mean the cheapest phone, the plan, the rate for the phone, it was cheap and everybody was could afford to have one of these phones, but it was a trick and a way how they could have just sent something through your phone and it would, it would, it would trigger something to your brain and have you acting not normal but acting like a demon acting like you're going crazy you would bite people you do anything at that time when it's crazy so it's like a remote control so man has the capability of doing things and we have to watch back in the days we had the obi man the science man you go to him you do whatever he gives somebody a soul food he calls somebody to lose their life he put a curse on this person well the science the word science it's, it's the same. A, a man that say he does black magic, he does voodoo witchcraft, he does all these things. His ability on what he's doing is on a different level. It's a form of science. It's just high science. We have a scientist that deals with science and they know longitude and latitude. They create, you know, uh, um, inventions and they do things that the ordinary person was not able to understand or comprehend the whole the whole intellect of what they are doing but God blesses people and give knowledge unto men so men could increase his his knowledge by uh, his invention for a better life but it's that same knowledge that's going to destroy us because we choose to use that knowledge in the way that will hurt other people so we have all these phones out here and every time we got new phones you would just buy a phone this year but next year you have to buy a next one because they will keep sending um data to your phone um software to your phone up, update to your phone when you update every time you update your phone goes slower so we know that the government has the capability of doing things that could cause harm to the people in every little sneaky way so it's scientific way they they get it uh so like i said back in the days what people mind was on witchcraft and and, 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 and and these type of stuff where people put spells and cast spells into people. That's a form of science. So like I said, they're different science. So now the scientist is a scientist, um, he's a scientist to the point that his science is even on a different level because now he's creating things that actually could hurt you. He's creating something and then he could wait after a year that you have it and he could go on his, in, in his motherboard and send all type of stuff that could affect you. So with the coronavirus, like I said, I don't understand, I don't understand to the point if this was a virus that always been there through the animals, cows, whatever. So like I said, the bacteria is moving from one animal to the next, probably from a bird to, 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 to a chicken, from a chicken to a, a fish, from a fish to a whoever, to a human being, whatever, however you get to intertwine yourself to getting that bacteria that is in whatever that you are eating or drinking, you get it. But it's beyond that. Because there is no way that the coronavirus should have anything to do with HIV. It, it, it shouldn't have the uh, same type of uh, uh, results that the HIV has. The HIV is a different bacteria that actually kills the anti-cells in the body. And it cripples the body. It, it, it leaves the body defenseless. So, and we see that there's a lot of diseases that is actually portraying to the other type of the disease. Every disease is fall in its own way, in its own, has its own pattern. You couldn't have 
the same disease like HIV, but now you get the, the same way it damages your body or it eradicates the immune system or it eradicates your, your vessel, your body. Now, here comes the coronavirus, and then we find out that there are certain things in the coronavirus that is affiliating with the HIV. So we know that definitely this was modified. We know definitely that is not a normal thing. We know definitely that this coronavirus was upgraded. You understand like your phone. You first you had the, um, you could have the S, the S8, and now here comes the S20. Or you had, um, the, you know how they do, they always go one level up, one level up, but they, they imitate from the original to the another one. So now, they only do, they don't boost the, the new invention, the new one that they put out, they boost it up a little. So six months from now, a year from now, they will have another one that will take a little bit of this and a little bit of that and put in that. And that's the same thing they do with the um, coronavirus. They took a little bit of HIV, uh, to, I would not say a little bit of HIV, but I would say a little bit of, a little bit of the bacteria or the what causes HIV within the lab, how they created that bacteria that causes HIV and that same bacteria was also created in the coronavirus to help to genocide. And like I said, they're not telling you the real thing. They're not because we only know about what they're telling us, but we don't know what about what's really happening. You should look into China, taking the news from China, see what's happening in China. Uh, this place they're talking about gone, gone, someone is gone. Where they stand the day the ones came out with the 5G with, 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 with the 5G and in China and now this this coronavirus happens to be in Gong uh, over there and that's where it breaks out from. So we gotta know what was going on. What what is really going on? Is it this something that is going on with the nations? And if this is something that is going on, because I know it's not natural. It's not. It's a man-made disease. It's not natural because, first of all, are uh, they saying they're saying it? It always been there, through people living or uh, close to the animals. They they have the the farms with the pig, the the farms with the cows, farms with the chicken, farms with the horses, the cows, whatever. And they live so close to these things that the defecate and the smell and the odor and all that stuff that. In, is in the livestock when people are living close to the livestock or living with the livestock that is how the um, whatever bacteria that affecting or disease that is affecting the cows, the cow, the fish, the bird, whatever since you're dealing in that environment that is there, this is how this um, bacteria or disease will move from a, a, a animal, dog, cat, bird, fish, whatever it is and come into a human being and then human beings affiliate themselves by you know some of them the things that they do in their customs in their culture drinking blood from the cow eating um, meat that is not cooked properly still have blood in it you know so yeah these viruses now but the key thing is when a virus moves from one vessel and enter another vessel you know that virus is going to create itself and cause itself to be stronger. So every minute the virus is teleporting itself from well, one vessel to the next vessel, it's getting stronger. So we got to ask ourselves, this coronavirus actually, is it just coronavirus or is coronavirus mod modified, modified coronavirus, upgrade coronavirus, coronavirus, on a level of mass destruction or it's like some cyber war thing going on where I I created I created a, 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 a virus that's gonna il eliminate and I get to find out yesterday I was watching this doctor forget his name and um he was saying that um this coronavirus was modified to eliminate Asian people to have more effect on Asian people. So I don't really know, but I'm simply saying, man is wicked and man creates a lot of things to destroy man. And by the things man do, it causes harm to the world, to the nations of the world. Because look now, this thing is going all over. 
this is spreading, spreading worldwide. So when we say, oh, don't worry about it, it's not that serious, or this and that and the other, the serious of it is the effect, what it's doing. It's destroying people, it's killing people, you see? And like the brother said, China, the doctor, um, H, I, I forget the doctor name, uh, but he was saying, China already made three hospitals, three hospitals in no time. So, it, for China to build three big hospitals to house these sick people, this is beautiful. This is excellent. Because I'm, I'm wondering, we over here, and it's, uh, it's starting to happen here. We don't know how long. We don't know our circumstances. We don't know the amount of people that's going to get sick. What would be the help with them on the government? We don't know how the government going to help them. We don't know what steps that the government going to take to help them. Okay? People panic. And people, when people panic, people do a lot of things. People start killing. They start looting. They start doing a lot of stuff. So, at least China has this problem. But they're going to deal with it. They're dealing with it. And you see how they're dealing with it by trying to isolate it, trying uh, to have places that the people could go and to get treatment. Now, I'm also hearing that with the coronavirus, they're saying the way that it's so modified, it's so upgraded that any on the males, they're saying it attacks the males more than the females. So they're saying on the males now, if the male man, if a male caught the coronavirus, and he can, he pulled through. They're saying, even though that he healed or he pulled through, they're worrying about on his erection upon his um, genital area, if he will still be able to function in that area because this coronavirus, it attacks the male genital area. So you could see where this, this virus, it, it is modified. You could see this virus, we thinking it's just from animals, but we are going to understand that it got a boost. They they took that virus and they boosted, it. they boosted it up, they acted up. So now it's out there, and you could see when people tell, oh, don't we get in the hype? This stuff is hitting all over. It's about hitting Europe. It's right here, right now. And we saying we don't have much people. Oh yeah, so we're gonna wait when we have a whole bunch of people to worry about this thing. So people, once again, it's Red Chat Black Star. Do not forget, keep your hands clean, wash your hands, wash your hands, wash your hands, purify your hands, use sanitizers, be mindful, your elevator, your door going into your building, your, your car handle, the gas pump, the uh, money, uh, you know, just being aware of all what you get, get in contact with, you look to clean and sanitize, or what you touch, clean and sanitize. Be mindful when you're not in a group, people in groups and they talk and they, 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 they're very close and this one coughing and say, well, it's nothing. Avoid groups, avoid being in groups, uh, avoid um, being in, 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 in close tight areas with a bunch of people, avoid elevators, uh, avoid like that close type of um, quarters with anybody. Peace and blessings, people. You're done now. The rich and black star. One love. Don't forget to love, share, and subscribe. And yo, share that video because I had to come back and touch the rest of the subject on the coronavirus. And now we're getting to find out that it's, the, it's, it's not just a virus, but it's a virus that is modified. It, it being hyped. It being boosted to do its job. And its job is to eliminate and to eradicate. And to the point where it leaves all the males that come in contact with the coronavirus, now they're wondering what it's going to be like after if you are not dead and you get over the coronavirus, what it will leave, how it will leave you, if it's going to leave you impotent to the point where you, your genital area is no longer good, it's not functioning. So we got to wonder what type of virus that takes over someone, makes them get sick, and if it doesn't kill them, then it leaves them in a cripple mood or state. So bless people, one love, peace and blessings.